Hello friends, it is James, and thank you guys so much for all the support that I've been getting on these kind of like advice type videos. Ones where I like just answer a question or if I have some sort of thing that I want to talk about or whatever. You guys are really seeming to uh, enjoy these and I've been getting a lot of comments on the videos and I've been getting a lot of uh, likes and all that stuff and a lot of good feedback. Everyone's saying it's like really good advice and all that stuff. Unfortunately, I'm not getting very many like topics from you guys. The more topics I get, obviously the more videos I can make. So please, if you guys have have any just any ideas whatsoever please feel free to throw them out don't think any of them are dumb questions or none of that stuff I need more questions in order to keep this sort of thing going but um I I on my last video I don't think I I don't recall getting really any topics or anything like that so I kind of had to uh, improvise and sort of come up with another topic of myself and so that's what I'm gonna talk about today oftentimes when I'm like when I'm watching videos and I see a video of somebody getting some like big drop or somebody getting like a lot of money from something or whatever from getting a big drop or a big split or whatever i often see a comment where somebody's like oh man the rich get richer and the poor stay poor and da 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 da, da. and let me tell you a little a little reason why this is true it is 100 percent true first off the rich are always going to get richer and the poor people that have no ambition to make that money are going to stay poor because this this applies you know in runescape this applies also in real life now if you see you see somebody that has a lot of money and somebody that is rich and all that stuff generally most of the time now i'm there's obviously instances and outliers and stuff like that where people are now this this is obviously real life um where people are like born into money or people like inherit amount of money or you know whatever that only applies to real life when you join runescape you you start out everybody starts out the same level three same items same everything okay now obviously i'm not 100 percent naive i understand that you know people spend money like real life money in order to buy you know gold on the game which you know that's a whole nother story. It's against the rules. It's something that you should not do. It's something that should not be done. And personally, I I would never do it because I value my real life money a lot more than I value a video game money. When I play a video game, I play it to play the game. You know, knowing that I earned what I have on that game is what is like is what I appreciate and what I feel like when I feel like I accomplished something. Uh, that's it makes me appreciate it more. So I'm not gonna spend you know a hundred bucks of my real life money in order to advance in a video game because the fun of that video game is the advancement part. Now obviously for some people that's not the case, that's just me. If you are if you don't enjoy playing a video game, you shouldn't play it, but that's besides the point. Generally, what I'm saying is there's a reason why people who have money, whether obviously like I said, whether it be on a video game or in real life, there's a reason that these people continually make more money while the people who have zero money or a low amount of money, you know, aren't able to make you know make money that way now obviously a person who has no money can get to that point where they can you know get to be rich and make even more money what happens is everybody has to work up to a certain point now if you're seeing a guy who goes and say he goes to armadillo and he gets a armadillo hilt drop you're like oh wow that guy and you know he already had like say full armadillo or full whatever fucking expensive armor and you're like oh the rich get richer da 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 that guy like I said, we all started out at level three. That guy at one point did not have that Armadillo armor, you know? That guy at some point was not able to go to Armadillo and solo Armadillo. Now, if you're if you're one of those people who look at people like that and they're like, oh, the rich get richer, what is stopping you from going and doing what he did in order to get that money? Now, if you say, oh, I don't have the stats, I don't have the levels to be able to go solo Armadillo like he does. Well, at one point, he didn't have those stats either. And he, you know, he threw working dedication and wanting to be able to do that himself he worked up and got to the point where he could go solo armadillo and he could kill armadillo efficiently enough to get a hilt drop or whatever drop now obviously i know that people get lucky people you know can go into armadillo and kill it on the first time and get a hilt drop like oh shit you know but he wasn't able to kill armadillo at a at one point and he went and did it and then from there he got money now the people who sit back and are like complaining about this guy who got an armadillo hilt drop are the people who are sitting back and they're wasting their energy and effort complaining about this guy when they could be focusing that energy and effort on training their stats up or actually going and killing armadillo and trying to get a hilt drop you know what i mean that's that's generally that's why 
like the, the rich people get richer because they have they at one point did not have that and then they worked up in order to get an armadillo hill job so like say you know this guy say say i've got full black dragon hide and i i have ambitions to one day own a full armadillo set along with a armadillo god sword now if i just sit there and i keep going like like i'm going and i don't go out to out of my way to try and make money I'm always gonna have that black dragon hide. Now, say I, you know, I have my black dragon hide. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go solo armadillo a few times. Maybe I'll get lucky. So I go solo armadillo, and say I get a armadillo chest piece. If I keep that, my gear is now better, and therefore I can go kill armadillo more efficiently, and I can get more kills in less time because I have better gear. So it's just a constant cycle of building your way up. Now that I have this chest piece, I go and solo armadillo more. I get the ch the chain skirt. I now have better gear in order to be more effective at doing what I'm doing and keep building my way up until eventually I get the armadillo hill drop. So it's all a matter of, you know, you, you start at one point and you go up and you go up and you go up and you go up and you just keep going up and eventually you'll get to that point where you have a shit ton of money. And obviously that's not, I mean, it's not going to be handed to you unless you are one of those people who goes out and buys gold, which that's a whole nother story. Like I said, if you want money, you have to work in order to get that money. Whereas if you're the guy who is complaining about that guy who is working and making more and more and more, you are going to go along a straight path and you are going to stay at the same amount of money or you are going to stay making a very small amount of money uh, consistently because you do not have no ambition and no drive to go and make the money that that guy has. Like you have, you have to put yourself in a position to make that money. You're not just gonna get it handed to you. So basically what I'm saying is the poor stay poor because they do nothing about it. If you're gonna go complain about the guy who got an armadillo hill drop, but you're not out there killing armadillo yourself, what right do you have to complain? You know, you're not putting yourself in a position to be able to be like that guy and you're not putting yourself in a position to get that drop. So it's not gonna happen. You're not gonna get that drop if you don't go and do something about it. And it's as simple as that and that, that applies, I mean, that's not only a RuneScape thing, That's that applies in real life. Like, people complain about, oh, you know, I make, you know, minimum wage at this job, but what are you doing in order to, like, get a raise or get a promotion or whatever if you're not just going to be handed those things in life? And that, like I said, that applies to both video games and real life. You have to work and work and work and work up and have ambition and drive in order to make more money. That's basically it that's i mean it's as simple as that hopefully it helps some of you guys who are the one you know if you're one of those people that are i know i understand that people don't have the time and the ability to play like a video game as much as other people and i understand that that's fine but if you are that person then you should be able to understand that you are not able to put yourself in a position in order to do that basically that's it um like i said uh if you guys have any more like just ideas topics anything in general that you would want me to talk about in videos such as this please 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 feel free to leave a comment i would appreciate it very much and i would love to you know have more videos like this and more questions to answer and more topics hopefully as always you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully i can get some questions and hopefully i will make a new one in the near future thanks for listening and i hope you guys enjoy this video